Hello everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. So my name is Shiva Ravindra. Today I am going to explain useful SAS techniques in efficacy analysis for oncology studies. So this is class 4. In the previous uh, three classes, I have uh, covered endpoint data collections, adverse event reporting, tumor measurements and assessment under resist guidelines overview. So in this class, I just given the overview about what are the oncology specific SGTM domains. So oncology specific SGTM domains are TU, TR and RS. These three data sets are mainly important for any oncology study. So what is TU, TR, uh, RS data set? I'll give you an overview about this uh, class so tu nothing but so tumor identification so whenever you are performing any oncology clinical trial so we need to identify where the tumor is whether the tumor was uh, you know compatible with our study or not so how can we identify the tumor so by using various techniques like mri ct scan or x-ray mri nothing but magnetic resources image so this methods we can identify the tumors the tumors are suitable for our study or not so based upon the tumors are two type already discussed in previous class target lesions and non-target lesions so which are measurable those are target and which are non-measurable mainly non-target lesions we can call but the non-target lesions which less than 10 mm size and target lesion greater than 10 mm size some of the uh, lesions we are not able to measure those are also comes under non-target lesions so here you can see as per the data set so that tumor identification the target lesions we are giving the numbering like t01 02 03 like that and non-target tumors we are giving the numbering like nt01 02 03 like that okay so that tu link id having that number and test and ORRS whether it is a target or non-target and which method you are identify the tumor you can find in the TU method and which location it was identified that information was captured in the TU location variable and what about the TR so TR nothing but uh, it is a measurement so TR nothing but what is the measuring uh, while measuring the tumor so what is the size of the tumor so we can include the data set called TR so target lesions we are able to measure right so longest diameter and you know shortest diameter and some of the longest diameter so those parameters are there so they will check and they will measure that size of the tumor in each time point and we can find that information in the TR ORRS. So first time 5 mm size and second uh, tumor 12 mm size at the particular visit. Third one 12 total sum of these tumors you know size was mentioned in the uh, sum of the longest diameter which one is the longest diameter. So we can sum and mention that number in the sum diameter okay. So here the TR data set also TR group ID mentioned non-target or target and in case of non-target so whether it is a present or unable to evaluate that particular tumor response etc. So we'll measure in the TR data set. In case of RS so previous class uh, we discussed about the responses so that responses was captured in the data set called response whether the tumor after treating our drug so which type of response given a complete response partial response or progressive disease or stable disease that response information was captured in the data set called rs so that response variable is rs or rs so these are the main and important data sets you can able to see in the oncology sdtm domains